Imagine waking up 100,000 years from now, in a world where everything you know has changed. The sky is no longer just a blue expanse. It's a living, breathing network of satellites, drones, and colossal cities floating miles above Earth. You step outside, and instead of paved roads, you find a network of glowing, levitating pathways that hum with the soft energy of quantum pulses. Buildings stretch beyond the clouds, their shimmering facades reflecting the light of not one, but multiple stars, each carefully placed in orbit by humankind's ingenious technology. Your morning coffee? Brewed by nanobots that can analyze your genetic makeup to provide the perfect blend of nutrients tailored just for you. Your companion for the day? A sentient AI assistant, programmed to not only cater to your needs, but to anticipate them. All this is the result of an incredible journey of human civilization. A journey into a future that was once just a figment of imagination. But now, it's our reality. But how did we get here? To understand, we need to go back, way back, to the early 21st century when humanity began its earnest exploration of the stars. At that time, we were merely a type 0 civilization, according to the Kardashev scale, a classification system developed in 1964 by the Soviet astronomer Nikolai Kardashev. The scale measures a civilization's technological advancement based on its energy consumption, starting from type 1 planetary to type 3 galactic. Back then, we were still fumbling with our basic resources, far from mastering even the energy of our home planet. Fast forward to 100,000 years later, and imagine a civilization that not only controls the entirety of Earth's energy resources, but has harnessed the power of multiple stars. A Type II civilization, according to Kardashev's vision, would have reached this milestone by building massive structures like the Dyson Sphere, a hypothetical megastructure that would surround a star, capturing every bit of energy it emits. Now, let's dive deeper. Imagine constructing a Dyson Sphere around our own Sun. This colossal structure, composed of countless satellites and solar panels, captures every photon of sunlight, effectively providing humanity with an almost limitless supply of energy. With this energy, we are not just lighting up our homes or powering our smartphones. No, this is an energy source powerful enough to terraform entire planets, creating new Earth-like environments across our solar system. Consider the Tabby star, located about 1,470 light years away, that has been perplexing scientists since 2015 due to its strange dimming patterns. Some theorize that these patterns could be the result of an alien megastructure, possibly a Dyson sphere. While we don't yet know if these speculations are correct, they serve as a tantalizing hint of what's possible for an advanced civilization. By this point in our future, humanity isn't limited to a single planet. Picture massive cities on Mars, colonies on the moons of Jupiter, and sprawling underwater habitats on Europa. We would have developed technologies to manipulate gravity, making space travel as routine as a car ride today. Imagine hopping onto a high-speed vessel powered by quantum propulsion, arriving at the moons of Saturn in mere hours. These technological advancements would be supported by a unified interplanetary government, coordinating trade, research, and resource distribution among different worlds. Each colony would serve as a hub of innovation, driven by the goal of advancing human knowledge and capability. In this future, artificial intelligence is not just a tool, it's an integral part of civilization. Picture machines that are capable of building other machines, factories that run autonomously, and AI that can design and execute complex projects like building space habitats or mining asteroids. But there's more. Imagine an AI that not only assists in mundane tasks, but engages with humans emotionally, offering companionship, mentorship, and even becoming an extension of our consciousness. In 100,000 years, AI would have evolved far beyond anything we can currently fathom, perhaps becoming our closest allies in the vast and mysterious universe. As our civilization continues to advance, we reach a Type 3 status, a galactic civilization. At this point, we have mastered not just the energy of stars, but of entire galaxies. Picture this, 
vast fleets of starships navigating the Milky Way, colonizing planets, harvesting energy from black holes, and constructing megastructures that defy the very laws of physics. With the power of an entire galaxy at our disposal, we could manipulate the very fabric of space-time. Faster than light travel would become a reality, allowing us to traverse the galaxy in mere days. We might even discover new ways to manipulate gravity, use wormholes for instant travel, or even create entirely new universes. But why stop at a single galaxy? Why not reach for the stars, literally? Now, envision the leap to a Type IV civilization. This is where things get truly mind-boggling. A Type IV civilization would be able to harness the energy of multiple galaxies, wielding power that seems godlike. Imagine controlling the forces that govern the cosmos, from the gravitational pull of black holes to the creation of new stars. Such a civilization could manipulate the very fabric of reality, create artificial galaxies, and even construct entire universes for their experiments or entertainment. At this level, we could have the ability to explore the concept of the multiverse, countless parallel universes, each with its own set of physical laws, waiting to be discovered. But could we go even further? What about a Type 5 civilization, one that exists outside of space and time itself? Such beings would be capable of creating and destroying entire universes at will. They would operate on a scale that we can barely comprehend, their existence spanning across multiverses, with the power to control every dimension, every atom, and every fundamental force. A Type 5 civilization might be able to manipulate time itself, traveling back and forth across the timelines of different universes, shaping reality to their whims. In this scenario, concepts like death and suffering might become irrelevant, as life and consciousness could be transferred across dimensions and realities indefinitely. The journey of advanced civilizations extends far beyond the boundaries of a Type 5 civilization, representing a mere milestone in the grand tapestry of cosmic evolution and technological advancement. Imagine a world where a civilization has unlocked the secrets of the universe and can shape reality itself. That's Type 6. A Type 6 civilization would wield the power to control the fabric of space and time, manipulating galaxies, black holes, and possibly even creating or destroying universes at will. Imagine beings who could engineer new laws of physics or create realities tailored to their whims. These civilizations might even have the power to move through different dimensions, accessing parts of the universe where current physics would completely fall apart. But hold on to your hats, because it gets even crazier. If you thought Type 6 was mind-blowing, get ready for the concept of a Type 7 civilization. At this stage, beings wouldn't just control universes, they would transcend them entirely. A Type 7 civilization could navigate the multiverse, hopping between different universes like they're skipping stones across a cosmic pond. They would understand the mechanics of the multiverse itself, able to create, destroy, or even merge entire universes at will. Their knowledge and control would be so advanced that they could rewrite the fundamental laws of physics, creating new realities tailored to their desires. Type 7 civilizations would possess intelligence so immense that they'd experience existence on a level completely beyond human comprehension. Now, let's push the envelope even further. Type 8 civilizations. If such a level exists, these beings would transcend the very concept of existence. A Type 8 civilization would not only control the multiverse, they would be the essence from which all multiverses emerge. Now, let's take a step back and consider another mind-boggling idea. What if we're not the first to have embarked on this journey? What if ancient civilizations have already achieved these feats millions of years ago? Think about it. A civilization that mastered the secrets of the universe, built wonders that could defy time, and eventually vanished, leaving behind only traces that still baffle us today. The future is not set in stone. It's a story yet to be written. And as we venture into the unknown, one thing is certain. The universe is vast, mysterious, and full of wonders beyond our wildest imagination. And who knows? Maybe, just maybe, in 100,000 years, we will look back and marvel at how far we've come and realize that this was just the beginning. So, 
Where does humanity stand in all this? If we manage to avoid self-destruction, we could potentially reach these levels of advancement in millions or even billions of years. But even getting to Type 1 is an enormous leap that will require unity, technological innovation, and maybe a bit of luck. Imagine our future, a civilization so advanced that we have learned to live in harmony with not just our planet, but with the entire universe. Imagine using the energy of stars, bending the very fabric of reality, and traveling across galaxies like it's a weekend road trip. From mastering the energy of our planet to controlling the universe itself, each step forward brings us closer to becoming a truly advanced civilization. What's stopping us? Well, maybe it's just our limited imagination, or maybe we're just getting started. So, keep dreaming, keep exploring, and keep questioning the world around you. Who knows what incredible things lie ahead. If you enjoyed this mind-bending journey into the future, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more videos that push the boundaries of imagination and knowledge. Let's continue to explore the mysteries of our universe together.